Hey everybody, Chris here from Contender Bicycles in Salt Lake City, Utah. Here in front of you today to talk about some bikes in probably my personally favorite category. That is the Long Low Slack 2.9er. We have three options in front of us here that we carry at the store. Um, we've got the Scott Genius 900, the Santa Cruz um, Hightower LT, and the Orbea Rayon. You know, a few years ago, the buzz was 27.5. The 29 wheel got relegated to two niner hardtails, two niner cross country bikes, and maybe some short travel trail bikes. And, and in three or four years, have things changed? Um, new geometry on these bikes has, has really uh, lit the category up. It's really, in many cases, becoming the go to for a lot of riders. Uh, each of these bikes has 150 millimeters of rear end travel, but they accomplish it in a different way. Uh, the Genius from 2017 to 2018 model is uh, the move from a single pivot design to a, far, a four bar. Uh, with the Santa Cruz, uh, we've got their proven VPP suspension design. And with the Orbea, we have something based off the split pivot um, design. Although all these bikes are you know, long, low, slack, two niners, they do have some unique features. Uh, the most notable with the Genius is their twin lock feature. This is something that's unique to uh, the Genius, um, or Scott rather. And the twin lock feature activates uh, both the front fork and the shock simultaneously in terms of the, the pedal platform or being fully open or fully closed. Um, you know, a lot of people really find that a nice feature. You know, you want to enhance the climbing, push a button and you got a slightly firmer platform for better pedaling efficiency. Uh, you've got to do a segment on paved road, lock it completely out. It, it really makes the bike versatile and uh, allows you or gives you a lot of control over your suspension. This bike in previous um, iterations has been a single pivot suspension design. This year it moves to a horse link or a four bar link. Uh, that's done a lot for the bike. Uh, the bike not only pedals better, but it also descends better as well. This bike has been considered more in the past of just a long travel trail bike. Uh, with the changes to the trash chassis, this bike is now a super capable do-all, all-mountain, large trail bike. Santa Cruz is a new brand for us. Uh, we just got some of these bikes in and uh, if you know anything about Santa Cruz they've really been doing a great job the last few years in producing some just amazing bikes. The Santa Cruz at first glance you know looks pretty straightforward. Um, its features to me sort of fit my sensibilities of, of having been a mechanic and dealt with various issues on a bike. You know, the one that comes to mind for me is a threaded bottom bracket. Um, the consumer is, has been asking and, and bike shop mechanics have been asking for, you know, brands to go back to a threaded bottom bracket. They work really well. You eliminate a lot of the creaking that's associated with some of the press fit options. Um, so to me, that's, that's a good feature. Uh, some other things that might not stand out at initially or seem like a, a feature, but you know, some of the lines are routed externally. Um, you know, if you get into a spot where you've got to change a certain line, especially a rear brake hose, having that line routed externally really simplifies things and they're smart in the location of the line, so it's, it's protected and um, yeah, I really like the Santa Cruz for that. One other notable feature is the fact that um, not specific to just this, this model, but Santa Cruz is the fact that they offer a lifetime warranty on their suspension bearings. I don't know of anybody else in the bike industry that does that, but you know, the fact they stand behind a, a, a part that's, you know, at times can be problematic or wears out. With the Rion, uh, they also use a threaded bottom bracket. Again, you know, that seems to be a trend. Um, there's been some resistance from bike brands to do that in the past, but more and more are adopting it and jumping on board. So I'm glad to see it here on the Rion as well. Uh, the Rion also is part of a customization program available through Orbea. With that program called Mayo, you can customize the paint, everything down to the accent color of the frame, the decal, uh, you know, basically make that thing look the way you want. And in addition to that, uh, you can build up the bike the way you want it. You can mix and match components, spec it the way you want to spec it. And, uh, you know, 
here at Contender, we're kind of, we, we like that. We build a lot of bikes that way ourselves. We, we do a lot of frame up builds and to see a company offer that, you know, as, a, as an option is, is good to see. As always, if you have any questions, if you need further information, please contact us at info at contenderbicycles.com. You're always welcome to come by and talk to us in person. We actually like that. Um, so yeah, uh, stay tuned for more and thanks for watching.